guys so this is another beautiful questions so let's start so question is this is the functional question composite this is given and you need to find out f0 so it's quite you know uh, whenever you see the first time it is look quite difficult uh but when you will be uh, like watching the uh, solution of any teacher it will look like a cakewalk for you so let's start okay so like unit f0 okay and this is the composite functions and quadratic right so like uh, it's not it's very difficult to find out fx directly here okay it's very difficult so like uh, in the first thought in my mind put x equal to 0 so it will be 1 right and let f 0 is equal to a okay and you got this so by putting x equal to 0 now f 0 is a so you can say f a is equal to 1 so my hand is down the output mill range f a is equal to 1 right f a is equal to 1 okay so now put f a in the you know above equation x equal to a x equal to a so f a will be a square minus a plus 1 but f a is 1 so f 1 technically you have a square minus a plus 1 right so just remember it now in the same equation same composite function x square minus x plus 1 put x equal to 1 okay let us put 1 so 1 minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 1 right so stick take let f1 is equal to k okay so similarly you can say f k is equal to 1 so same information okay now put x is equal to k so f of f k will be equal to k square minus k plus 1 f k is equal to 1 f k is equal to 1 that will be k square minus k plus 1 but f 1 is equal to k f 1 is equal to k so k square minus k plus 1 so now like k is <coughs> k is equal to f1 right k is equal to f1 okay so so from here k square minus 2k plus 1 is equal to 0 this implies k is equal to 1 this is perfect square right okay. this is perfect square so you got f1 is equal to 1 so in the previous slide f1 is equal to 1 right f1 is equal to k is equal to so f1 is equal to 1 right so from first and second so from what we got f1 first we got a square minus a plus 1 and in the second we got f1 is equal to and k is equal to 1 so f1 is equal to 1 right so this is 1 actually so a square minus a plus 1 this implies a square minus a is equal to 0 and this implies a is equal to 0 yeah 1 or either write this way 0 or 1 okay okay so 0 and 1 we got let me write in beautiful way let's say a is equal to 0 comma 1 okay now what is the equation let's see a is random number okay a is random number so f0 is equal to a so you have two options f0 is equal to a either 0 
either one okay but this is function for any input for any input you can't have two values you can't have two values so it will not satisfy function equation then okay then this will not be function so uh, f0 will take only one value either zero either one so let's see let's see here how to you know identify so f0 either zero or one and we have function x square minus x plus one put x equal to zero here so f zero is equal to one and f zero when first case if you are considering you are considering f zero is equal to zero is the right answer so f zero will be zero this is zero this is one and f zero is zero so zero is equal to one this is not possible so uh, now conclusion is your answer is f zero is equal to one no need to check if you want you can do okay if you want you can do so this is our right answer so this is answer f0 is equal to 1 thank you guys to subscribe our channel because most of the uh, you know guys watch our video but do not subscribe so please do subscribe thank you guys